thanks for coming back to PokerNews.com. I am here with Ben Lamb. And Ben, you live in Las Vegas. You were there all summer. What made you decide to fly halfway around the world to South Korea to play short deck for the first time? Uh, well, I didn't come here just to play short deck, but uh, you know, short deck's becoming more and more popular. I'd never played it, and uh, the only stakes I've been invited to play is like very, very high. So I thought if I came here, I could play this tournament at least, get my feet wet without risking hundreds of thousands of dollars. Uh, and I like it so far. It's a lot of fun. Uh, it has some simulators of PLO, which I was told. Um, but more action, more all-ins. Uh, the equities run really close, so you just get to gamble, which is fun. <laughs> it is. Now, are you studying it, or are you sort of just playing and learning as you go? I mean, I, I bought the $10 poker calculator. You know, it tells me the odds. Uh, but, no, I mean... Playing mostly, just playing and trying to get a feel for the game, and I think everyone's doing that. I'm sure some people are studying harder than others, but I don't know. It's it's uh, it's fun so far. It's fun to not have to study for poker and like have fun again. Yeah, yeah, it is. It's it's always fun to learn a new game. This is the newest game, so here I am learning it. Okay, so yesterday was your first day. What did you learn? Your first day playing? I learned it's really important to win your all-ins. <laughs> uh, True of all poker. <laughs> uh, I, I mean, I guess. Um, I guess I learned that you just kind of got to see a lot of flops and, and get in a lot of, you know, get to get down pre-flop and just kind of not fold, I think, is the, is the name of the game, is fold much less than any other game. All right. That's, that makes it way more fun. Yeah, of course. You get to go all in. And uh, this tournament's really fun because they give you three barrels, so you get three chances every, every 100K Hong Kong. So you're not in for hundreds of thousands of dollars yet, but there is some bigger buy-in short deck tournaments coming up. Are you planning on playing that depending on how well you do, or are you just here and going to play no matter what? Uh, I think I want to play them. Uh, I wasn't sure when I came here if I was going to play the bigger ones. I knew I was going to play this one to, you know, like I said, get my feet wet. But uh, they're fun, and, and I think I'm learning every day. So I think I'm going to play the bigger ones, yeah. All right. Now, we saw you on the rail of the World Series of Poker main event final table. You've made the final table yourself twice. You were coaching John Sin, helping him out. How did you get into coaching, and why do you think you sort of have a knack for it? Obviously, he went on to win. What is it that you sort of provide to these people at the final table? Uh, I don't think I would call myself a, a coach or anything. It's just my friend, and he didn't have a whole lot of experience heads up. He's a good poker player, but he didn't have a whole lot of experience heads up, and I knew as it got shorthanded, uh, you know, if, if I can help my friend win the tournament, you know, like the, the white whale, you know, uh, the main event, uh, you know, that I, I would get enjoyment out of that, and, uh, you know, he's a really smart guy and hopefully he's set for life at this point so I uh, just want to help my friend more than anything. Well, how was it what was it like being on the other side of it because you've been at the final table with your own rail and then you're on someone else's rail sort of you know watching the live stream helping him out. Yeah uh, that was actually a lot of fun it was not as stressful but still stressful. Uh, Sean D was coaching uh, Tony Miles so it was kind of fun trying to figure out what Sean was telling Tony and and you know they were both so tired not everything was you know, being taken in, but um, you know, it, it was it was it was fun. More more than anything, it was a lot of fun, and and the right guy won. Right. So I'm happy with that. It was the result you wanted. Correct. Yeah. Well, I hope for uh, more results you want here <laughs> in uh, Jiju. Thank you. And thanks for chatting with us. I appreciate it. Stay tuned. PokerNews.com.